Welcome to World in Two Minutes. These are your headlines. The UN says the Sri Lankan army and Tamil rebels committed war crimes during the country's 26-year-long civil war. Earlier this week, the Sri Lankan government said it would set up a Truth and Reconciliation Committee to deal with the allegations. But the UN says the court should be an international one. The war ended in 2009 and it's believed that at least 40,000 people died in the last five months alone. Police have registered about 150 refugees who've entered the country from Serbia. The government says it's come up with an emergency plan in case of a bigger influx of refugees. Earlier on Wednesday, Hungary closed its border with Serbia to protect what Prime Minister Viktor Orban called a Christian way of life. And on Tuesday, Budapest declared a state of emergency in two counties along its border with Serbia. It happened as new laws to curb the influx of refugees came into effect. Police are now allowed to detain asylum seekers who try to cross the razor wire fence Hungary has built along its southern border. The International Monetary Fund has approved $11.8 million in financial aid to support the country's emergency economic recovery program. Central African Republic is set to hold general elections in late October, but the interim government has reported it's behind in preparations and may have to postpone them. CAR has been in conflict since 2013. Thousands of people have died and hundreds of thousands have been displaced. Some scientists have questioned whether fossils found by archaeologists at a university in South Africa are really a new species related to humans. The South African scientists had named their discovery Homo naledi, but a scientist at the University of California says that the fossils belong to Homo erectus, a species discovered in the 1800s. Thanks for watching TRTWorld.com, Istanbul.